Well, he wants to wish it well, a directly respected figure. Shabby. And we are just about ready for the off. And what is an ideal night for football here in Catalonia? And it will be Espanol to get things going. Xavi's opening assignment as Barcelona coach is a derby meeting with Espanyol. A rivalry dominated by the Blaugrana. Xavi knows that he's going to be a key player in the future. Jordi Alba with the delivery. Away by Raúl de Tomas. Here's Mingue Sáenz. He's a member of the Spain Olympic team. Earlier this year, made it all the way to the final. Losing to Brazil. The Alba slips it through towards Frankie de Jong and Memphis Depay. Difficult one to catch sweetly. Yeah, that ball. was an interesting approach from Barcelona. They went direct. Exactly, we were talking. Memphis drops a little bit for the run of uh, de Jong inside the box. It's very difficult for a defender to make that run because you don't know if you have to follow Memphis Depay that is arriving in the second line or following Raul de Tomas. Sparkly player on the right, Anthony Embarba. He can do a bit of damage. It's a very effective shot when all is said and done. Barcelona have got to be mindful of him. Herrera. No free kick forthcoming. Thinking of Carlos Del Cerro Grande. And now with Memphis Depay. Dutchman has options inside the box. Waiting to pull it back. Too much height on it from Nico. Fluency from Barcelona. Yeah, we've seen a little bit of the space in a good contact from Barcelona trying to. Just gets forward to Frankie de Jong. And now Espanyol really need to cover up. Did they overcommit? Memphis Depay. And he might get a second crack at it from a tight angle. And Diego Lopez is there for the Blanqui Blau. We can see now that Barcelona also has got that. They're going to try to make quick transitions as well. They made the pay making the run, good movement, getting away from, from the defender and frankly young quickly to give it the ball and that bounce. I think it, it makes a chance on La Liga and try to keep the hope. So why not get the trophy at the end of the season? They really have been a breath of fresh air. We also see that. Elias, not a bad ball. To attack it at the far post was Gabi. By Cabrera, the uncompromising Uruguayan for Espanyol, but the visitor's defence being tested here. Away by Andrea Pedrosa for Espanyol. They're under the cosh. Barcelona drilling at the moment. Espanyol trying to make quick runs into the boat. Tefu now. Memphis to Pai. The goalkeeper doing enough. Diego Lopez. Sort of Memphis had straight anyway. On the ground here, Diego Lopez. Having taken one for the team. See where yeah. Memphis Depay big, was. Big risk over there. I think it yeah. was offside. Yeah. But trying to keep and make himself big. And Memphis is not one of those players that you want to be brought so close <laughs> when he's going to try to shoot. Was brave. To put in these challenges, the Espanyol defenders. That was Sergi Gomez. It's Barcelona that is not struggling in, in contact from Espanyol at the moment. It was a misplaced pass by Alex Vidal to get back to his defensive position. Here's Elias Ingesa for Barcelona. He headed away by Pedrosa. Jordi Alba. Gabi. This is Nico, it's Busquets, and Lopez away. Got his gloves to the ball, but offside. Espanyol is start suffering a little bit. You, when you try to make that good transition, we can see here Nico arriving against in second line. Good strike from, from Busquets, good save, but it was offside from uh, Memphis Depay. And Espanyol is, like I mentioned, when you try to, to go forward, it's a lot of space that you, that you have to cover. Long runs 
and now they've been 30 minutes of running behind the ball. They are four players staying in the other side of the globe from set place. As Busquets. Mateo. Mateo back into the stride of Gabi. Real accuracy there from the youngster. Ripple of applause there. Good movement now, quick on the ball. And he tries his luck. Tomas and there's Minguesa. Wonderful work by Raul de Tomas and it took a deflection and it was a close shave in the end. And I'll tell you what, not Minguesa's proudest moment defensively. No, that sometimes it does happen with Minguesa gets wrong. You cannot go behind and lift your door. You can see he covers the, the, the place that he doesn't cover you. If the goal is behind you, you need to cover the ball the first and let him let Raul de Tomas to get the ball. That's very well. He crosses and to go 1v1 against against the left back, the Rosa. Here's Gabi for Barcelona. Behind him, Eric Garcia. Well, Gabi getting on the end of that one. And a fine pass. Memphis to Pai. Down he goes. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Complaints from the Espanol players, but he didn't really hesitate. Carlos Del Cerro Grande. And it's a big moment right at the start of the second half of the Catalan derby. Very good combination, fair passes, good runs inside the box. You can see Memphis waiting for the chance. Not sure if he touched first the ball, the defender we're going to see here. Preferably because he makes the contact and that's it. I'm not sure if the VR is going to go for it and he's going to call it because as you can see there, it is a small touch. So, uh, I think the Cabrera touched the ball, definitely he, he touched it, yep. as you can see there. But he touched a little bit as well, Memphis, so the contact, but unfortunately uh, he touched the Memphis on the run to goal and he was called for, for a penalty. The decision stands, Memphis Depay misfired from the spot recently against Rayo Vallecano. A distinctive short run up from Memphis Depay dispatches this one to score the first goal of the Xavi era. Good strike, good touch. He waited a little bit, he got his time. He have a good breath in, breath out, to calm down the nerves, to wait to see what the, the keeper was going to do. And he's got a fantastic touch. We've seen him taking free kicks, penalties already. It's true that he missed one, but um, he waited this so well. And it's not easy. Diego Lopez is a very good, very good keeper, very big. You can see there, he touched it, touched the ball but also slides and, and touch Memphis. Great strike, no chance for Diego Lopez. One nil for Barcelona. Seventh of the season. Well, Memphis Depay and a very animated celebration. They're all keen to perform well. Xavi's first match in charge. A disappointed Diego, Diego Lopez for Espanyol. Memphis jumping for Japan. Can Espanyol reply immediately? They very nearly did. Managed to get players forward, including Barba at that time. A warning issued by Espanyol. The substitute trying to make his mark. Salzuri having come on. Teasing and tormenting, Alex Vidal away, not decisively, and it fell for Busquets. Abde, that's what he can show, that's what he can bring on the table. 1v1, one one, definitely a lot of quick quick feet, good cross, but he's definitely not, not, not afraid of, of get the ball and, and go against players and beat players. Was that Barba earlier, Luis, but there, doubled up here by Gabi for Barca. Nico, Barca are on the move and a hole at the defence and it's a delightful chip but it's offside, Frankie de Jong and he's often criticised for not scoring enough decided to bide his time and it was a sparkling finish but not to be yeah, a lot of his a metre of offside Nico, good chance for Espanyol this one Barba at the ready for Espanyol in there, but he takes aim. Barba, and it 
comes here and no real accuracy it wasn't clean at all from Bolanis a bit disappointed to much time oh wait a minute at the other end a glorious chance for Raul de Tomas and it caught everyone by surprise out of seemingly nothing Alex Vidal just steered it forward and there was De Tomas you can't blink on this game slipping uh, the defence of uh, Barcelona having their own private little match for a few seconds there Coutinho and De Jong Abde on the right and he has a spring in his step and he was 